I thought about what my aha moment would be in space before I left the planet. And I thought it would be when we install the Columbus Laboratory with a robotic arm, because that was my, my job and my primary mission objective. That paled in comparison to when Peggy Whitson, the first female commander, invited us to have a meal in the Russian segment. She said, you guys bring the rehydrated vegetables, we'll have the meats, right? She said that. <laughs> so we float over with this bag of vegetables. We get there, and it's African-American, Asian-American, French, German, Russian, the first female commander going around the planet every 90 minutes at 17,500 miles per hour. And I felt like I was at home. We were breaking bread with people we used to fight against, the Russians and the Germans. And when I looked out the window at Lynchburg, Virginia, my hometown, and then I'm thinking my parents are probably having meatloaf down there, right? Five minutes later, we're over Paris. Leo Eihartz is looking down. His parents are probably having wine and cheese or something. And Yuri's looking off at his parents probably eating borscht in Moscow. <laughs> so in this very short period of time, we are celebrating all of humanity as we go around the planet. And that perspective shift that I got was my aha moment. And so if millions of people can get a chance to go to space and get this perspective shift that I got and get this connection back to the planet, I think it will advance our civilization, it'll advance our race, the human race, so significantly. So, My opinion. Yeah.